Hey guys, uh, today I'll be showing you how to calculate the number of pips on TradingView. There are many ways to calculate the number of pips on TradingView that you can start with. So you can see here, we have this rule here, which is the measuring tool here. Okay, this one it's gonna be here when you just open your TradingView account or your register account. This is the simplest one it's here so you can measure here your entry it's here you just you click once okay you don't hold on this one you just click once okay you left click once and then you just drag it wherever you want to drag it and then when you are done you click again okay so you can see here it's saying 400 and negative 439 pips okay so this is from here to here it's 439 pips okay but uh, the main disadvantage with this one is that the moment you click anywhere on the chart it disappear okay so what you can do there is another tool here which i use which is this one the price range okay so i've already added here I've already added this one on my favorite tools but if you want it let's go and look for it I believe it's here let's start here it's here so you can see here we have the price range too okay so you can just grab this one click it and then once you click it you come to this level of your entry here and then you drag it going down okay so you can see here if we push a little bit down we have 441 pips okay so these 441 pips this small okay so the main advantage with this tool is that if you click here it doesn't disappear you can click anything you can do anything it doesn't disappear unlike the measuring tool here so another way to calculate your peeps is to use the short position we have a long position we have a short position so this one automatically also covers your stop loss calculation so let's just put it and you get to see so here is it here it is we put it here and then once we put it here let's drag it let's drag it down let's drag it down let's drag it down here so our entry is here at this level here so these are entry at this level here and then we target price to get to this sell side liquidity here so you can see here we have 441 pips okay so these the number of pips here and this is the money you want to make here so let me just see how much we started with so you can see here it also have um, your stop loss so you can see how much you are risking on your stop loss so you can see these are stop loss here the amount that you have it's thousand us dollar 980 so you are risking 61 pips okay so this is the number of pips that you are risking for this case here so these are the tools that you can use on trading view for you to be able to calculate your number of pips 